guys, Tyler here. Welcome back to Dicey Dungeons, the dice deck building strategy game. We're returning with Jester, and on episode two, the rules change every time, and <laughs> this is different. Where's my deck? I have a one card deck to begin with. Well, reroll this, I need something better here. Okay, so I have a very tiny deck that's a, a sword. It's like the, the first char character, the warrior. Well, that's terrifying because I'm getting zapped. I guess I'll just deal six and then hope I don't take much more damage. Nope, that's gonna hurt. Oh, this is strange. So I keep going back and forth between the Jester and the Witch being my favorite character. I know I said Witch last episode, but I actually really do like the Jester because I also like standard deck builders. And this is actually a fun kind of deck builder where you can just draw and draw and draw and draw and create like a bit of a miracle deck. And you do add cards to your deck. Yes, I will take claws. If going from one to three is huge. So deal damage, add poison. Interesting. I'm, am I going to die on floor one? Is that possible? It might be possible. No, it's okay. I'm going to be fine. Never mind. Let's double this and finish them. Okay, so these move like cards. Now the question is, will I actually get a physical deck? I don't know, but at least I got my HP back and an extra die. Die. Let's go to the marshmallow. There's cards hiding behind it. This is a very strange change of the rules. So now I need to reroll to get lower numbers to activate claw. Eat my ass? Eat my ass. Okay. Great. Awesome. Good turn. <laughs> hopefully I'll get the ability to skip stuff and hopefully I'll get like a finishing card eventually. Oh good. Okay. That's actually bearable. Uh, but I could do better than one. I would like a two or a three, please. I would like a two or a three, please. Three's good. So first, I will take the damage, and then I will limit break the three. And then I'll claw. Because I'm pretty much guaranteed to win next turn. And then I won't touch the fire. Maybe I didn't need to limit break. That's plus a few damage. Okay, do better than one, please. There we go, that'll do it. GG. So let's see, adding new cards in my deck, what will this do? Poison, maybe? A spare four? Is this just the four I can save for later? Shield might not be so bad. Oh, you collect them all? Yeah, I'll take them all. So what's the deal with my deck now? I now have five cards. So how exactly does a game play? Do I just get five slots or does it, maybe it, sh oh yeah, I probably shuffle and draw just like a deck. I'm gonna reroll the four actually. Nice. Um, now I can reroll the two. Okay, I got a five, so I'll put this here. Does this come up? Yeah, I do draw stuff. I just get a four. <laughs> Very cool. All right, so honestly, keeping a four doesn't matter that much. I kind of want two low ones. All right, so it still functions like a deck. Hopefully I get a finale card because that part was also fun about the Jester. I mean, I, I just like the Jester a lot. So this four is useless. I'll actually just use the sword right now. And I'll use the claw. I mean, that's as good as it's gonna get. I'll use the shield. I mean, I'm maxing out, so why not, right? Give me another claw use. Yeah, that's good enough. You're dead next turn. Oof. Ouch. I'm angry. Mm, but I'm gonna win. I don't believe I have any healing. But I got the natural heal. Boomerang. To deal two time damage to enemy, enemy, but damage to myself. That one's fun. I'm gonna go boomerang. Why not? It's max chaos. Upgrade's nice. So is uh, destroy card isn't that good <laughs> at this time. Upgrade is actually good now. What do I wanna do? Yo, I'm really curious. What is this upgrade to? Oh, it just gives me two damage? Lame. What is this upgrade to? Oh, deal only three to myself. That's. That's pretty good. I like less self damage. And let's take on the Dryad, because yeah, I would love to deal 12 to them, three to me. Fury with that for 24 damage. Pretty good. This sucks. A little better. Okay, I got three, I should just use that. Let's see what I get here. Five's pretty good. I can claw here. And if I get the boomerang, I could be all right. Oh, oh, ooh. 
Wait, look at this. Wooden shield. Fury boomerang. Here we go. I only take two. No big deal. One turn kill. This build is sick already. Aggro build. I think that's why I like the Jester a lot. You can just build a deck that's fast and absolutely smokes them. Head to the left, another anvil. Okay, I I'm liking this a lot. So this one stinks. All right, six is nuts. Now, I'm actually, I guess I could just chuck the five into the sword. Here's the thing though, right? I have only two th um, things, two pieces of equipment that can actually use a die above a four. And I have three above a four, so I should just re-roll this. Okay, now I can re-roll the five. That's pretty good. So I can sword. I can shield. I will claw for sure. I think boomerang, yeah, boomerang is fine. How do you hurt me? Sometimes you just don't. You could brick. Hey, that's what I'm talking about. But I do lose 2 HP. I mean, it'll be fine. Um, let's do 3 shield and then again with boomerang. Okay, I think I actually would have taken damage if I didn't block there. I saw the thing happen, so I'm glad I did block first. Oh, upgrade or card pack first? You know what? I'm gonna go card pack first. I, I'm pretty sure I can take this fireman. Especially with 28 HP. Thank you for the 4. I will re-roll a four. Fives are okay. I'm okay to use a shield. Do a claw. I think I should be happy with fives. I'm probably not going to do better. Ten to him, three to me. That's that's fine. Uh oh. Oh god. I'll tell you what. That's painful, but I am about to win. Surely. The one downside about this special game mode is that I cannot get rid of the uh, the claws. I can't discard the two of a kinds. I reroll this, see what I get. You know what's crazy? I'm actually gonna reroll a six. Okay, didn't make a difference. I'll claw and hope I can get lethal. Yes, good, good, good. Okay, it's fine. I'm not gonna die. And I'm about to level up. It's fine, it's fine, it's fine. I can save the fury for the next fight. This is actually perfectly good. Oh, I forgot this came with. We chillin'. I was actually thinking I would have had to do it that, but I'm glad I didn't have to, though. Yeah, this seems worth it. Bump is awesome. Taser's okay. I think the bump is well worth it, though. You know what? Then I'll upgrade the spare four. Two free damage. Yeah, the other upgrades can only give up to two damage bonus, so this is two guaranteed damage. It's way better. Well, not way better. Slightly better. Ooh, okay. This is looking good here. Bump this. Can I win? That's the question I have to ask myself. Ooh, it's getting a bit more likely. There's a chance I can win. I think I can win. <laughs> I think I can win as long as I don't super brick, which I think is very unlikely to happen. So always sword here. Oh yeah, forgot about that. Yeah, I super win. I probably could have even shielded. Um, maybe could have shielded. I don't know if I could have guaranteed it. And what does it matter anyway if I healed a full? Do I want to destroy a card? I'm actually considering it. Crystal Sword is pretty cracked. Actually, Crystal Sword has to happen for sure. And I'm on, actually. Let me look at my deck. What would I get rid of? Maybe a Claw? Claw is four damage. Taser is three, but shock is good if I don't one turn kill. But I'm kind of one turn killing, so I might get rid of Taser. Yeah, why would I not want a deck that just one turn kills every turn? That's clearly the strongest of decks. Well, does that mean I get rid of Wooden Shield? No, because Wooden Shield can save me against <laughs> my self damage. So goodbye. And on to the next floor. Feeling pretty fast. I'll make my way to the card pack. Let's see what happens. What the? What are you doing here? Oh, okay. You thought you could hide from me or something, huh? I'm actually gonna bump the four into a five here. Skin with some poison. Because I wanted a crystal sword. I guess it's not gonna get furied, but this is still good. Regular sword. And now, 
Yes, spare four. Oh, that's big. How, how do you hurt me? With odds? I do not kill you. But that is okay. Next turn I will. I just need six of a way to deal six more damage in my deck, because that was maximum damage without fury. Oh god, this turn is going to suck. Good thing I did that damage while I could. Damn, that is sad. Good thing I got the spare four. That is nice. Well, I can't heal. So any way to give myself free damage. Bump and Venus Flytrap. That's pretty good. I might be shooting myself in the foot here, but I think it's fine. Let's see. Super enemy? What? What's your deal? Maybe you just have more dice, or...? Well, guess who doesn't give a damn? <laughs> Let me just casually... Uh, get him? Alright, I would like to heal. There's no way I'm gonna be able to do that, though, right? I mean, maybe. See if I can get a chance to heal. Come on. Yes. Yeah, let's go. Super enemy, my ass. I'm the super enemy. Fear me. Right, I'm about to heal the full after this fight. Might as well eat it. It's level four enemy. So I didn't even learn what a super enemy is. I'm sure it's cool, though. Well, maybe I'll get some good values here. It's not a great start. That's better. Here's what I'll do. I'll do Venus Flytrap right now. I guess I'm not bumping the six. I got Crystal Sword. Okay, keeping the five. I'll re-roll. Let's just send this. This is always happening. And now I'll just hope to get something good. So I get Boomerang Plus here. Drop him to 11. That's solid. I'll... Ooh. Take a bump. Shield and hurt. Could not get the free four. That's fine. Do I really think I need it? I'll be okay. Mm, will I? Yeah, the combat roll should carry me to a win. Good start. Yeah, this should already be winning. But just in case it's not, I'll keep running it through. But Oh boy. Shield bash. I don't have that much shield. One day I'll have to try a shield battle, but upgrade card is wonderful. Considering I have things that both triple and double my attack damage, I feel like bump is more powerful than normal. And Venus Flytrap triggering on six. Yeah, I think bump is actually vital for this deck, so more instances of bump will go a long, long way. Oh, I can upgrade and destroy. Beautiful. First, I will upgrade the other bump. Every day of the week, and then... What am I getting rid of? Either Claw or Shield. I still kind of like Shield. I think I'm actually willing to get rid of one Claw. I'm probably not using two Claws in one turn, especially now that I got two Bump Pluses. Oh, I gotta get to that other upgrade. Huh. Can I start with this pack? No? Wait, there's a Rotten Apple? Oh, this is an enemy! What the hell? <laughs> in that case, I will be ignoring you and make my way towards the upgrade instead. Okay, so it begins. It's so always five into six. And how about I do a four into five here? But you know what? I'll do a... Well, actually, how do you attack? Ah, okay, pretty big damage. I'll just do Boomerang Plus right now. See if I can hit a six. A four, huh? I'll take a reroll right now. Okay, I'm willing to send this into the sword then. Show me bump plus. Hey, let's go. So now, gotta preserve the five. How about I just use this? Preserve the five. And I'm gonna be one off. Is there any way I can deal one extra damage after- Well, I can combat roll, hit a five or a six, and then bump plus? Is it worth it? Is it really worth it? Actually, I think I hit all my big damage dealers anyway, so I probably should just wooden shield right now. Yeah, I didn't have any more damage left in my deck. Good thing I did the math before, because I'm like, wait, he had 46 HP. That means that simply, even if I dealt to my max damage, I wouldn't be able to one turn kill him. So now, well, now I want to get my six. 
So I'll just bump twice and VS fly trap. Perfect. Now, do I actually want the upgrade yet? Or maybe I want to consider getting cards first. I probably should have gone for the cards first. It's a level four rotten apple fight. I think I'll be okay. So I should be able to turn one kill him at you with Fury easily, actually. Or Venus Flytrap. Double Crystal Sword. You're done, kid. Well, not yet. Soon, though. Five into six. I could do better than three. That's good enough. Deal the damage. I don't want Boomerang to hit me. Here's what I'm gonna do. Just give me a low number now. That'll do. One turn to kill. Perfect. Oops. Didn't matter. And the second I knew I won, everything goes out the window. So, flip a dice upside down and repeat next action. Chocolate cookie, when leveled up, becomes a nine. Chocolate cookie is tempting. Spatula is okay. Uh, can I actually fit in chocolate cookie though? So I spend nine and the best I would get would be an additional 15 damage. Would I spend nine for 15? That's best case scenario. Would I spend 12 for 15? Let's start with that. It's technically better than average, but that's only best case scenario. You know what? Fine, let's try it. I, if I lose, it's because of that decision right there. How about I find out what's in the shop before I go to the anvil? Let's see. So here's the thing, like what if chocolate cookie just ends up being used on sword? Wouldn't that stink? Wouldn't stink. Okay, but now I, have claws to do fives and the sixes. Let me see what this gives me. A little better, please. Four, okay, four into five, five into six. That's better. Yeah, this is awkward now. It's like whatever I get next is gonna have to be doubled. But then what if I just draw something ass? So now I have to play sword. I'll use a five on this. Yeah, chocolate cookie's now bad here. It just gets in the way. And I can't Crystal Sword now, it's too late. I mean, I, if I knew my draw order, I suppose, but I obviously don't know that. And now Spatula sucks. Yep, I messed up. Um, you know what? Halfway to Chocolate Chip Cookie, gu guaranteed win next turn. Maybe I could have blocked? No, I'll be okay. At least I know that I don't like, oh, okay. Next equipment is plus one use this turn. That's pretty bad. Spatula minus sucks. Oh, this is the same three. It's not shuffled. Well, I might be screwed then. I mean, I could get rid of this at least. This is not that big a drawback. Do that. Wait, so does my... Because I started in the middle of my deck, did the other cards get shuffled? Am I gonna draw those? Here's what's gonna be up. I'm gonna add shield. Well, let me try something here. Bump it. Got claw. I can win right now with chocolate cookie into claw. So even if I don't get anything cool, it's all fine. No, I don't win. That's not, no, I win otherwise though. I've, I am fine. Let's see though, if I have a bump plus lying around or if I can get a six for healing. No. Okay, I will sword. I do get the bump plus back. Okay, okay. So the deck shuffled back in. Learning. And finding out what lies in the shop. An upgrade. Okay, so after one more coin, I'll be able to upgrade again. That's, that's nice. About to heal the full and then get two upgrades. It might be okay. So it begins. I'd like to win this turn. See what I roll into. See what I roll into. A little better. Got a three. Okay, because I'm locked into a three, I can feel okay with claw. I will sword like a normal human being. And I would have gotten crystal sword. It's fine, I'll still do it. Bump plus. I want to keep the four for wooden shield, so I'll bump this three. I don't really have any crazy six value except for boomerang, but that's okay. You only hurt me on a six, right? Oh, hold up, hold up, hold up. Maybe I can still win? 
Maybe? Well, whatever. I'll win next turn. Oh my god, wait, spatula! Oh, spatula is good! Yes, turn one kill! I had no cause to be nervous either. But I, I, I just love getting turn one kills. And my deck is now about to become insane. First off, it's gotta be Chocolate Cookie. Let this actually be useful. And now to the shop. And hell yeah, I'm taking another upgrade. So, what's it gonna be this time? This lets me get two extra damage in a turn. I think I'll take it. And with this upgrade, I have more upgraded cards than non-upgraded cards in my deck. Six to five. How crazy is that? I think this should be easy. I think it should be super easy. Unless if this boss one turn kills me. Actually, why do that when I can do the one turn killing? Of course. So one of the six, always. How about I know what I'm gonna get with combat roll? Mm, I can do better than three. That's pretty good. I'm gonna actually start with a five. I have three fives. Got a bump. I think I'll actually go four into six here. Here's the cookie. I would like to use it on Boomerang. Or the 15 damage one. Either one. So get this out of my sight. Yuck. I don't think I can one turn kill anymore. I think Chocolate Cookie was a mistake, but funny enough, Spatula ended up being pretty cool. Yeah, not quite a one turn kill, but it's... Well, actually, technically still possible to kill. Do I still have the free dice somewhere? I don't know. Let's see. Oh, <laughs> well, it is what it is. I tried. Did uh, 49 damage in one turn. One of these days, I'll get a turn one kill on the boss. Oh, yeah, try to shield. I dare you. If I, I guess if I had Fury ready. Here was my issue. I used Fury, and then I just never took damage. So I wasn't able to pop off with it. So it shows me. Anyway, it should be GG. Should be. Um... You have 13 HP. It's not GG yet. It's anything but. Oh no, I can boomerang. Never mind. Never mind. We chillin'. GG. Well, there you go. <laughs> that was a fast one. Holy crap, that was super speed run. Just one turn killing almost everybody. I am looking forward to the next Jester fight, as well as just more episodes. I'm probably going to do some characters I didn't expect to do before. So thank you all for watching. Hope you guys enjoy. See you all in the next episode. Have a wonderful day and peace.